A few days to their first semester examination, students from the Entrepreneurship Study Center, Benue State University, came out exhibiting their works of art and creativity, only to be forced to vacate the campus due to an industrial action. Members of the Academic Staff Union of University's Benue State Chapter had on the 1st of February 2024 embarked on an indefinite strike to press home their demand for earned academic allowances, promotion arrears and payment of a percentage salary to recently employed lecturers. This informed an intervention meeting called by the Benue State House of Assembly Standing Committee on Higher Education as parties present their cases. The Assembly uh, asked us to give them the opportunity to step in. So we asked for a document which would take back to our Congress. So finally the Congress would take the decision. Uh, for us, they have not yet been settled to our satisfaction, but uh, it's our Congress that's the principal. So we'll go back to Congress and Congress will chart the way forward. This has been a crux of a matter for uh, as soon nationally and even locally. And I can say that for any allowance without contradiction that uh, BSU is even ahead in terms of integrating it into the salaries. And this is what federal government has not been able to do with federal universities. But we're hopeful that federal government will also begin to do that. And at the level here, aside integrating into salaries, we are paying the EAA when we have resources. And the assembly has promised to intervene. So we need to look forward to that intervention. While the House chairman speaks on the need for all parties to put the students' future first, the majority leader calls on the governor to spare resources from ongoing projects to safeguard the future of the students. The students were supposed to take exams three days before the strike was called. And we felt that there's a need for us to intervene. There's been logjam. And so our intervention is basically to see how we can mediate and resolve the crisis so that the, t the teachers can go back to classes and the students as well can go back to classes. Uh, we've, we've had some robust engagement with management and with ASU. Uh, we also have leadership of the assembly stepping in. And we believe that within the next few hours, this would be called off. Because we, we strongly believe that our appeal to the leadership, to the, manage, to the management of the university, and also to ASU, they would see reason and call off the strike. So that we can all go back and be proud of uh, the state called Benway State. The general problem we have in Benway is the scarcity of resources and the enormity of the problems we have. But uh, as we agreed in the meeting, BSU is our only pride. And we, if it means that we can uh, do everything, I mean everything, to make sure that their problems are solved, we are going to do it. And I think the governor will listen to us because we are here uh, to serve Benue people. And that's the first step of serving our community. The last eight months have seen massive construction work on 16 township roads and other key infrastructure in Benue State. But the lawmakers believe the future of the Benue State students should range higher on the administration's priority list.